Welcome back. This is Elena Dennis, and we're continuing our two-step lesson. I think now we just did Tennessee Saturday Night, and in it was a figure we really didn't do a teach on, and it's referred to among many cures as a lucky rat, though I don't think it's an official documentation that way. It's not a uh, defined figure. But it consists of four figures. They're relatively easy figures. We just put them together. It's in many two steps, especially two steps that are very upbeat and make you want to dance and have a nice lively feel, though not necessarily fast, okay? So anyway, let's take a look at this figure. There are four parts to it, as I said. The first part is easy. We all know how to do that. That's a vine three. So we start with our lead foot and we go down line one, two, three. Now the next part, I want to just practice in a different way with you first. Get her with the lead hand and we're going to twirl in three steps. Okay? You're like this. Your trailing hand is not holding on to her. We're just going to practice a twirl vine in three steps, the way you would normally twirl a vine. One, two, three. Let's do it again. All right? We're back here. We're doing a twirl vine. One, two, three. Now, while we're in this position, I want to reverse twirl vine. So we will reverse twirl vine. One, two, three. So we'll twirl vine down and back, as we sometimes say. All right, ready? We have our lead foot free. We have our lead hands raised to do a twirl down and back. Ready? Twirl vine down and twirl vine back. One more time, ready? Twirl vine down. One, two, three, and twirl vine back. Quick quick, slow. Okay? Now, let's do a twirl vine down. One, two, three. Let's reach for the trailing hand and we will hold on to this hand as we twirl vine back. One, two, three. And we assume a wrap position. Okay? Let's do it again. Let's uh, get more in the center of the camera. All right, so we're going to do a 12 vine. No hand hold, 12 vine. Now I grab the trailing hand and we reverse twirl back. One, two, three. And we're right next to each other. If it'll help, do a hip bump. Okay, and we're both facing line of dance. All right. Watch it one more time. I'm doing a twirl line, down line. I grab the trailing hand and I reverse twirl back and I turn on the last step so that we're both facing line of dance. Okay? Now, I'm going to do that rap, but instead of starting with a twirl, I will start with just a vine three. So we have our hands connected, lead hand, trailing hand. I'm going to do a vine three. Now we will wrap. I will raise this hand to do a reverse twirl. I don't have to grab for this hand. I already have it. And here's the reverse twirl. One, two, three. All right, let's try that again. We are in butterfly. We'll go, instead of twirling down, we'll just vine. Keep it simple. Vine three and wrap. One, two, three. All right, that's the hardest part of this figure is that wrap. All right, I know many people want to raise this trailing hand to wrap. Most of the time in a two-step, you don't twirl under this hand. All the twirls are done under this hand. Whether you do a twirl to a tamara wrap or a regular wrap, all the twirls are done with the lead hand, okay? And that's, that's especially true at the level that we dance at, all right? I'm not saying it doesn't happen at other dances. So, ready? We find three, one, two, 
and raise the leg here and wrap. One, two, three. Now the next figure is an unwrap. We unwrap by dropping the hand that's in front. You drop the lead hand and the, your partner, the lady, she rolls away from you in three steps. While you step in place, keep time with the music. One, two, three. And we're opened up in open position. All right? So watch it again from the beginning. Do it if you would. Vine three, raise the lead hand, wrap. Drop that lead hand, unwrap. All right, one more time, and then we will do the last figure. Vine three, wrap, lead hand goes up. Drop the lead hand, unwrap. Our next figure is called a trade sides or a change sides. I'm not sure different cues, I get in the habit of doing it, saying it different words, but we do. If you're a square dancer, we do what would appear to be a California twirl and roll to face. All right, we raise the trailing hand. So here I, I'll have to take back what I said earlier about the girl not going under the trailing hand because she does go under in this case. We raise the twirling hand, the trailing hand. She will walk under and I walk around her. Okay, she walks under, in three steps, I walk around her, and we turn the face. Okay, so again, we're in open position, we have our trailing foot free, and we change sides. One, two, three, and turn the face, and we're ready to do it again. Find three, raise the lead hand, wrap, Unwrap, change sides. I may have to take that back as far as using a trailing hand because we do do another figure where the lady goes under the trailing hand and that's a lace. So, boy, I've got to take back a lot of words. So again, we're in butterfly, vine three, wrap, Unwrap, change sides. Very often, it's followed by another one, the identical figure. You'll do it once on one side, and then once on the other side, facing the other direction. Sometimes it's interrupted, you'll do something different. But in a number of dances that I've done, not all of them, a number of them, You'll do it one way and then the other. So let's, let's try that. We'll do that to music. We will do it twice. All right? Ready? Find three. Wrap. Unwrap. Change sides to butterfly. Find three. Wrap. Unwrap. Change sides. Face to face. Back to back, basketball turn. Ready, butterfly, find three. Wrap, unwrap, change sides. Find three, wrap, unwrap, change sides. Face to face and back to back. Basketball turn. Butterfly, find three. Wrap, unwrap, change sides, face to face, back to back. Basketball turn. Butterfly bind three. Wrap, unwrap, change sides. Two forward, two steps. Hitch six. Lace across, lead in. Then trailing hand, she goes under. Face to face, back to back. Basketball turn. Butterfly vine three. Wrap, unwrap, 
changed sides, and I think we ran out of music. All right. Again, uh, it's been referred to as a lucky rat. Uh, properly, what I would do is if I wanted to cue the word lucky rap, I would first lead you through it on the first time through the dance. And then I might cue lucky rap the second time, okay? All right, that's, uh, that's a wrap. This is Elaine and Dennis with the Shoe Leather Express in Gloversville, New York. Until next time.